that, Catherine? That's very good. All right. Perfect. You have a nice view of the paper and the paints. All right. So I'm going to use this smaller flat brush and uh, I'm going to do some twists. Oh, I know this. Yeah. Can't go wrong with a twist. And a dab. They're like, um, remember when I did those paintings that were all little contained spaces that were nestled into one another? These kind of remind me of that. Yeah. Or that's, that's what I feel like I'm working on. Like a really complex puzzle. Yeah. So that they're figures in relationship to one another. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that. Mm -hmm. So this is fun to just be wiggling around with my brush. You should try it. I, I am going to. I yeah. What color? Okay. Huh? What color is that? Oh, this was, a, it was a, a blue that I mixed in with a green. You need to talk again. Oh, yeah. So this is a little bit of purple. Next time with a blue. And uh, yeah, I should tell you what colors I'm using. This is um, cerulean blue. And this is the um, cadmium red light. Mm -hmm. Get a clean brush. I like the What'd you say? I like the colors. Yeah, so this is cadmium red light. Um, Yeah, I like that too. I'm gonna put a little bit of it in here. A little richer. And I want to get some. That blue is called Prussian blue. The Prussian blue and this green, the phthalo green and the Prussian blue have really, are really dominant, strong colors. So this is the, see how dark that is just in its own. So I don't want to use too much of it, but I want to mix it with some yellow. See what happens. Maybe I'll just, so I have on my brush now the blue and the yellow and see what that does. Look at that, Catherine. Mm. You like that, I know. Don't want to give that up. So 
I got that from just, you know, mixing the blue with yellow, but instead of doing that, I'm going to mix it with this red. So I have both of them on the brush. Mm. Oh. Yeah, so that's the, red, the cadmium red light and the uh, brush and blue together. And I get some darker colors in now because um, there's not there's not a lot of contrast. I, I want something to stand out a little more. Okay. So, um, but I don't. I like what I've done, and I'm not sure I like to do any blowing out of anything. But I might. Let me just try that because there are still some wet places that I could blow out. I'll just try that. Like right here, that might put some things over in the yellow that help out there. It's not going very far. I don't want to do anything in there. Oh, that thing's moving. Doesn't want to go anywhere. Well, I gave it an eye anyway. Mm -hmm. well, your paper wasn't wet when you started. That's right. So I think I, I don't like how that yellow isn't, isn't interesting at all. And uh, I want to put something in there. <coughs> Maybe this blue. So I'm, and the green too, I'll put something in there. The paint's too, too thick. So I put some little water in there. And uh, I think everything else is all right. But I'm not sure what this is gonna do. See what happens already. Push this back. Well, that at least is a little more interesting. It makes the yellow and the green be more of a background for something that's is a little more interest. And that there's still a little light, so I wanna put something else in there. Maybe some yellow. That doesn't work. Some uh, blue. Oh. 
Well, kind of makes it messy. Clean up this splotch here with wet paper towel. Whoops, that's that Prussian blue asserting itself. Mm -hmm. Doesn't like to give up. It's really stained. It's a staining color. The other, most of the other colors really wash out more easily, but the Prussian blue stains the paper. Like blueberries. And then down in this corner, this lower part of the paper, I want to put something dark down there. Maybe I'll do something like that. Mixing the this Prussian blue with uh, this red. And then over here too. There. So that it kind of grounds this side of the paper and paper but I like that. I might do it over here too. You need to talk. And uh, so I just, I wanted to ground things better in a darker base. So I think I'm done, Catherine. Okay. Um, Eric, could you record and then share your screen? Open up, open up the uh, screenshot and then share your screen. Get out of where I am. There you go. Um, so I see, uh, oh. I see. I have to open my screenshot. It's yeah. not there. Where is it? When you're, um, you might not be able to do it when you're recording. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. 